What up guys, Becca Mondays. Happy Monday, everybody. So this week's topic is connection to our bodies. Um, I'm gonna give my own experience because I'm not gonna speak for everybody else, but my experience when I started to develop the masculine, which is the voice, the hair, everywhere. Um, I'm one of the lucky ones. I'm fucking hairy and I love it. Um, I just, I fell in love with myself so much more. And to be completely honest, you guys, being a trans man is exactly who I intended to be. You can't call me full man. You can't call me full woman. I'm never going to deny the skeletal structure of my birthright body, but my soul is not doesn't match up with the skeleton, the, the body itself. But in reality, we're all men. I mean, woman, seedman, man, however you say it. We're all men. Hate to break it to you, anybody who wants to claim, but we are. It's just it's just part of the label, guys. That's all it is. Uh, there you go. Thank you. Yeah, please. Thank you. Thank you. Um, for me, I fucking, dude, I just, I love myself. I love my body. I love everything about it. I love the growth. Even the, the acne when it was coming in, I was like, oh my God, I've never had acne before. Um, but every day, you know, I meditate, breath work, um, saging, all the spiritual stuff that people are talking about. But if you actually apply it and actually do it, you just learn to appreciate life. Um, so honestly, the connection, even right now, I have sage water. <laughs> And that's just to keep my head clear because you know with, with all these teachings and all these things that we've been influenced by in society you know it really has an impact on you if you allow it to but i choose not to i choose to live my own life i make my own decisions i listen to what people have to say but ultimately i make these decisions for myself as we all should um if you have any issues with your body, ask yourself why. Is it too feminine? Is it too masculine? But it's okay, you know, if you're if you're going through this transition and you're not getting where you want, it takes time. It takes patience, you know. You didn't get this far overnight. So if you guys... Thank you so much. Have a good one. So if you guys are having trouble accepting your bodies, just know that you... Um, right turn. You have grown from the age of in your mother's womb to who you are now and whatever age you are now. You know, it took time to get there. And so, if you're feeling a disconnect with your body, you know you're 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 going through it because you're literally changing, but you're still in your body. It's your body's just showing you. The, the awesomeness that you've been asking for. So, you know, that's probably the best piece of advice. For me in particular, I'm, I'm in love with myself. <laughs> Sounds super cocky, but I love every fucking thing about my body, man. It's not a damn thing that I, I complain about, except, you know, and if there is, I will work on it like my butt, my ass. Uh, I'm gonna bigger ass, you know? So I gotta work on it, you know? I find things and I bring solutions. So that's my best my best piece of advice to you guys. All right, um, any questions, shoot a, shoot a message over, uh, share this video, tag your homies, um, follow us on Instagram, and I will see you guys later, man. All right, bye.